Our second sacrament is Holy Eucharist. I'm sure that if you're watching this, you've probably experienced the Holy Eucharist. It might have been a while because we haven't done this during the pandemic until recently, but maybe you remember coming to church and worshiping together. And during the service, there's a time in which we remember what Jesus taught us and we break bread and we eat the bread together and we drink wine together. This is what we call the sacrament of Holy Eucharist. This rite, it was commanded by Jesus at the Last Supper so that we could remember his life, his death, his resurrection, and his promise to come again. We do this almost every time we come together in worship. There are some other names for the Holy Eucharist you might hear. The Lord's Supper, Holy Communion. What do you think is the outward and visible sign in communion? in the Holy Eucharist? What can you taste and see? The bread and the wine. What is the inward and spiritual grace in communion? The inward and spiritual grace in Holy Communion is the body and blood of Christ given to his people and received by faith. When we eat this bread, we are nourished. We are strengthened in our union with Christ and with one another. And we are given a little taste of what it will be like when we are together in that heavenly banquet. You might notice that I'm reading here from the Book of Common Prayer. If you have questions about the Holy Eucharist, you can find a grown up in your life and ask them to find a book of common prayer and to look at the catechism with you, to look at our service of Holy Eucharist and to learn more about this sacrament. 